Holmes, Robert Holmes. In the tradition of showing you some of my trinkets from the back shelf, this here is my official Sherlock Holmes hat. It was uh, on my late father's desk uh, shelf as well, so it's kind of cool. I'm going to wear it. I'm going to wear it today. Colorado mug. All right. This is getting into some racy stuff. Apparently, it's a uh, sex again. So we're gonna we're gonna start reading some of these. All right. Number one hundred and thirteen. If men could get pregnant, abortion would be a sacrament. Oh. One hundred and fourteen. Ever since young men have owned motor motorcycles, incest has been dying out. Okay. Uh, that was Max Frisch. 115, Goodman Ace, 1899 to 1982. Familiarity breeds attempt. Ah, see where he's getting there? Instead of contempt, it means once you get to know somebody, you kind of get a little, you know, I get that. All right. 116, Robert Byrne, Sex Drive, a physical craving that begins in adolescence and ends at marriage. Ah, good one, good one. Unknown, 117. Sex is the most fun you can have without smiling. He's right. He's right. And it was unknown, but that was it's pretty good. It was really good. Okay, Mark Twain, 118. I would rather go to bed with Lillian Russell, stark naked, than Ulysses S. Grant in full military regalia. Rodney Dangerfield. We got two Rodney Dangerfields in a row here. I'm going to do my best Rodney impression as well. Last time I tried to make love to my wife, nothing was opening, nothing was happening. So I said to her, what's the matter? Can't think of anybody either? <laughs> no respect, no respect. 120 Rodney Dangerfield. If it weren't for pickpockets, I'd have no sex life at all. <laughs> no respect, no respect. 121. I've tried several varieties of sex. The conventional position makes me claustrophobic, and the others give me stiff neck or locked jaw. That was Tallulah Bankhead. Stiff neck or locked jaw. Sexual positions. Okay. Number 122, Carl Krauss, and this one is asterisked. A woman occasionally is quite serviceable substitute for masturbation. A woman is occasionally quite a serviceable substitute for masturbation. I can't confirm or deny that one, folks. I can't confirm nor deny. This is one of my favorites, asterisked. Sex is nobody's business except the three people involved. Ah. <sighs> We're going to end with that one, okay? We're going to end with that one. And that was unknown. All right. I love every single one of you guys, and I'm proud of you for sticking it out, staying indoors, uh, coughing into your elbow, all that stuff. We're going to get through this, and we're going to have a good time. And when we get out, we're going to have a party. I promise. We're all going to be there. All right. Later.